Here's Sophia Cannon now, chatting with Jim Courier. Sophia, um, okay, you're into the finals of the Australian Open, and I don't know that you believe that yet, but it's true. How, how did you win this match? You faced two set points in the first set, two set points in the second set, and yet here you stand, a straight set winner. How did it happen? You know, um, she's such a tough player, you know, I know she's playing really, really amazing and I knew I needed to really find a way to win and thank you guys so much, you know, this really wasn't an easy one, but I'm just so grateful and thankful for this moment. Obviously, you and your dad have, have traveled a, a long way to be here. You've traveled a long way together. He's been your coach from day one. You guys started early. Just describe what this means for you as a family to be here in this moment. Honestly, I'm just so speechless. Um, I honestly can't believe this. I've just dreamed about this moment since I was five years old with that anti-erotic video. I'm, I'm sure you guys saw that. But, um, yeah, um, I'm just so speechless, so thankful. I've worked so hard to get here. And, you know, just thanks to everyone and to my dad and everyone and everyone back home. So thank you, guys. You're, I uh, know, you're, you're doing great. You did great on the court. Playing Ash in, in this stadium cannot be easy. Dealing with the heat, which popped up out of nowhere today, also not easy. And she brought her slice back in and big time in the second set. What adjustments did you need to make to find your way back into the second set? Because she was getting on top of you there for a while. Yeah, um, she came up with some really great shots. You know, it was, it was really tough. I knew, you know, she's, gonna, she's not going to give it up to me. You know, I really needed to fight out there. And, yeah, I mean, she's a great player, you know, and... There's a reason why she's real number one, but I mean, I'm just so thankful for this. I get it. I'm, I want to bring, bring back that Andy Roddick video for a second. You've been around professional tennis players since you're five, six, seven years old. You, you played a lot of charity events in Florida. I remember one in particular where you played a doubles match and you played against Venus Williams and Todd Martin, and you had a doubles partner in that match. Do you remember who you played alongside? You. See, I remember. <laughs> how, how old were you? Oh God, I don't even remember. I mean, seven? sure, I guess seven, but... Um, Did we win? I think we won. I was, Who, who's going to be the seven-year-old, right? I was a feisty kid. You know, I'm sure we won. <laughs> I can tell you that hasn't changed a lot. Well, you're going to bring that feistiness into your first major final. Uh, what are you thinking about as you look forward to that one? Simona Halep and, and Garbina Muguruza will play here momentarily. Your thoughts on playing against one of them for this title? Um, I'm not even going to look. Um, I'm just going to relax, enjoy this moment, and you know, whoever it's going to be, it's going to be a great match, and I'm just looking forward for the final. We're going to go let you celebrate with your family. Congratulations, Sophia Cannon, ladies and gentlemen.